Hey everybody, this is uh, Dan from CareStream Dental and um, I've got something new and exciting to show you guys and that's the new version of the CS3D viewing software. That's version 3.10.43. This version of the software is still, just like all of the uh, previous versions of the CS3D viewing software, free and unlicensed. Uh, you can go to carestreamdental.com and download this new version of the CS3D viewing software. You can reach out to your distributors, your local representatives, or you can reach out to CareStream Dental support uh, to get this new version of the software. And you can install it on any of the workstations that meet uh, the re recommended specifications. So. Um, here we've got a scan on an adult female using the CSAD 203D Neo Edition CBCT. Um, I'm, you're going to see everything in real time here, okay? So I'm going to open up this case. Uh, one of the things that you should experience with this and the previous version to this of the CS3D viewing software is about a two times faster opening of these uh, CBCT scans. The, this new software is optimized so well. Right off the bat, we can see uh, when opening up this case for the first time, we have a, uh, a progress box letting us know that it's tracing out the arch, not just the mandibular arch as it's done before, but also the maxillary arch. So we get two arch tracings in the same scan. It opens right up to uh, the mandibular arch um, and that looks really good. But let's check out the maxillary arch too and that also looks very good. So um, we also notice here in the tools box, we have the AI auto arch tracing, which we've had for a very long time. But now we have the AI nerve tracing tool. So we have auto nerve tracing that's included with this. In order to use this, we have to use the auto arch tracing. This doesn't work if you're going to use uh, you, if you're going to trace the arch yourself. But let's see how this works now too. So I'm going to click on auto create arch and we get another progress box here. Again, this is all in real time. So you're going to see just how quickly this works. Once it's done, we should also see this switch right back over to the mandibular arch. Let's make sure. Great. Um, we get a dialog box here. This is going to let us know that we need to be a little discerning about the information that uh, uh, was created here. Uh, it did switch us back over to the mandibular arch. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the uh, transaxial view to verify uh, the placement of this arch. We're going to do, we're going to start off on the right side. So I expanded the transaxial view. We're going to use that uh, blue slider now, the movement handle to go right over where that nerve tracing is. And we can see that that was, although there's not a ton of density uh, in the bone, we I can still see that the AI, AI nerve tracing did a great job of mapping that nerve out right where it's supposed to be. So let's try the left side out now too. And that is really, really good. Really well done. Now each of these dots, if something say needed to be moved, each of these dots is gonna be a point where we can actually reposition that if necessary. But um, you know, just a, a quick glance here, uh, I don't see that really anything needed to be moved. It was really well done. So again, this new version of the software is version 3.10.43. This is a free download from carestreamdental.com. Reach out to your local reps, reach out to CareStream Dental Support or your distributor uh, to get this new version of the CS3D viewing software. Thanks, have a great day.